Hello everyone, and welcome to my Bachelor official YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. Previous single man Ben Higgins is sharing his considerations on Caitlin Bristow and Jason Tartik finishing their commitment. Single man country was shaken when it was at long last affirmed that their relationship was finished. In any case, not at all like different parts in the establishment, Caitlin and Jason are behaving. What is Ben's take on their split? Continue to peruse to figure out more. Ben Higgins is perhaps of the most regarded name in the single man establishment. He and Ashley Iaconetti have the practically renowned web recording, and this week they talked about the finish of Caitlin Bristow and Jason Tartik's commitment. The connection among Caitlin and Jason finished in the wake of being together for quite some time. The two were supposedly arranging their wedding, albeit an authority date had not been set. Ben accepts that the manner in which they finished things was truly sound. He said, This is a sound parted. It's a miserable split, since you and I have been around them a lot, and they appear to be truly really great for one another. Ben and Ashley both accepted they got an opportunity to, to make things work in view of the time they enjoyed with them behind the scenes. Caitlin and Jason have not shared the specific explanations behind their choice to isolate. Nonetheless, it seems as if Ben accepts the split was brought about by inconsistency. Ben said, perhaps that is the reason it's a particularly miserable thing for the two of them. Since I'm certain there were ordinarily they were like, wow, this is the most gorgeous thing of all time. Be that as it may, clearly, you know, they weren't viable. Obviously, that delivers more inquiries regarding the reason why he thinks they were not viable. Ben went further into why he accepts their split was solid. In general, it was the way they took care of things and how they imparted it to their fans. He believes it's undeniable the two have a great deal of reverence for each other in view of the photographs they shared alongside their proclamation. In the event that they had a terrible parted, there could never have been a profound clarification, and they positively wouldn't be co-nurturing their canines together. As a great many people notice, regard and love for one another don't ordinarily exist several finishes things. It's undeniable they arrived at the choice to end their commitment together. Both Caitlin and Jason have had only pleasant comments around each other. Caitlin even implied that maybe the entryway isn't shut and they could accommodate from here on out. What is your take on Ben saying they were not viable? Remain tuned for additional updates. Fans initially met Cassie Randolph on season 23 of The Unhitched Mail. And since her experience on the show, she's kept her more than one million supporters refreshed with her life via web-based entertainment. This week, Cassie took to Instagram to commend her three-year commemoration with her sweetheart, performer Brighton Reinhardt. Close by sweet photographs of them, Cassie expressed three years with a red heart emoticon. A significant number of Cassie's kindred, unhitched male country stars showed the couple love on her post, including Katie Morton, who remarked, Love you all to such an extent. Elise Delbum and Heather Martin additionally remarked hearts and shared their affection for these two. Cassie and Brighton previously ignited dating bits of hearsay in August 2020 when fans saw the couple getting to know one another with her family in Huntington Oceanside, California. They likewise began preferring each other's web-based entertainment posts around that time, and close to a year after the fact in July 2021, the two hard sent off their relationship on Instagram. At that point, Brighton shared photographs of both of them together on the ocean front and inscribed it, Supplement messy inscription here asterisk. The next month, Cassie showed up in one of Brighton's music recordings for his melody Dreaming. We are so blissful they are as yet going areas of strength for so love seeing Cassie so infatuated. Blissful commemoration, love birds. 
Look further into this single man country star. Fans got to know Caleb K on Causes Time of the Unhitched Female, and presently he's opening up solely to BachelorNation.com, addressing 20 quick fire questions. Get to know Caleb K somewhat better beneath. Another theme I love discussing is green textures are seriously abused as I would see it. And negative, I'm not one of them. Yet I feel like I ought to involve this chance to pronounce myself as a partner for green textures all over. I think a superstar couple that is the meaning of relationship goals is Owen Wilson and Vince Vaughn. I realize dislike that, yet this science is certain. 3. My extravagances, sticking out to my zero zeros emotional playlist when I'm distant from everyone else in the vehicle. Nothing very like the youth works of art to get me out of a funk. The best relationship exhortation I at any point got was, openness is absolutely vital. My zodiac sign is underscore 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 and my most insert zodiac sign, quality would be Leo. My most Leo characteristic is that I am exceptionally faithful to individuals I'm nearest to. My greatest annoyance is Atlanta drivers. Additionally, the way that 285 has been under development since I was conceived. Simply surrender it, as of now. The principal thing I do when I awaken is blend a pot of espresso large enough for a whole Waffle House then continue to drink the whole pot. My keep-going feast on earth would be pizza and wings. Neither of these are my number one food. However, when they're together, it makes me truly cheerful. The tune that generally gets me siphoned up is Safeguard Ye Neck by Wu-Tang Family. My secret ability is brushing rises off my tongue. The responses I get are continuously engaging. The individual that motivates me the most is my folks. The two of them endeavor to ensure my sister, Hannah, and I had all that we wanted growing up. The film I've rewatched the most is The Waterboy. Recall the time Bobby Butcher appeared at halftime and the Mud Canines won the Whiskey Bowl, do ya? Yeah. My number one emoticon is the Red 100 emoticon, just utilized at improper times. The last thing I researched is top 10 urban areas for youthful experts. My main thing from being on the single woman was being around the folks in general. I genuinely delighted in getting to know everybody and making a ton of truly old buddies. I didn't have the foggiest idea what's in store going into it, yet I was enjoyably shocked at how amazing this gathering was. Being on the unhitched female instructed me. The most effective method to act naturally and not stress over the assessments of others. It is insane to feel that I might have passed up this staggering experience being stressed over what individuals could think. My superstar crush is Anna de Armas. Hannah, assuming you're seeing this, I love you. In the event that you go on, the single woman, remember to pack your own liner without a doubt. It was a flat out lifeline. Much appreciated, mother. Something I actually have from my experience on the Lone Ranger S is the pink Speedo from the Dodgeball Bunch date. Yikes. Where do you see yourself in five years? I see myself proceeding to pursue my interests and doing the things that make me the most joyful. Ideally, I will find an accomplice en route who has similar qualities and objectives as I do. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.